And then at the end, he gets kind of what he deserves. He gets stabbed to death. Yeah, he gets stabbed to death. Cause he, cause he basically didn't listen to anybody. She told him, "Don't let Esther around the freaking children." <laughs> and he, he just left. And then he, he died. She the just only stabbed thing, him at least twenty times. The only so, thing great is that uh, the children didn't die, of course. The, I mean, the boy almost did. Man, she almost <laughs> lit that boy up. First she tried to bark, burn him alive, then she tried, then he fell off, <laughs> then he fell out of a tree, and, um, and then she tried to strangle him, oh, man. and she didn't succeed. Oh, she had succeeded, he, they just resuscitated him. Yeah, they resuscitated him. <laughs> That's how he got, came back alive. But, but anyway, but, but Esther, Esther is a freak of my nature. Yeah. <laughs> Let's talk about the death girl. She was a she played. I think she played her part pretty good. Oh yeah, movie. she she is she's the icon of this movie. Yeah, just so. just really great. All right, let's talk about some of the flaws of the movie since we we got a lot of stuff good stuff about it. All right, for one thing, Esther's character character development wasn't that good. She it it was a it was all nice and pleasant until she caught. The two getting it on in the kitchen. Oh my god! <laughs> she caught her mom and dad. Her mom and dad her uh, so getting mom her dad. so-called mom and dad getting it on in the kitchen, and she <laughs> she, uh, she has uh, she's an artist and she draws she draws at pretty much everything she sees up on the wall, but she uses some kind of neon stuff yeah. like when like when you turn on a black light it like uh, shows some hidden messages she wrote. Any, anyway, she's psycho. She is psycho. <laughs> she's extremely psycho. Bob Beyond. <laughs> anyway, her, uh, that's probably the only thing. Uh, all of a sudden, all of a sudden, uh, she starts to show her true colors. I mean, uh, one, one, what was the one part that uh, that that uh, that made the movie? Oh, uh, the, yeah. She walked in on them. The next day, the next day, uh, the mom comes in and says, uh, "Does the, the you know does the mommy sex talk?" He's like, "You know, some some you know adults." grown-ups when they love each other uh, really really much uh, they want to express it in that kind of way do you know what I do you know what I mean yes I know they want to F <laughs> they, yeah, basically they wanna, she said she that, said yeah I, yeah I know they <laughs> Yeah, basically, she said it and, so calmly. And yeah, we don't like cursing. That's yeah, why we don't we don't like cursing. But, but she said it like it was normal, and and that, and I thought that was like there's something wrong with that. And no, was, no, so. that's the only thing. Uh, it it just happened abruptly. The cursing started right there, and then it went just full blown. Everybody yeah. just went crazy. F this, f bomb, f bomb, f bomb. I just I think uh, we just went. I mean, it was just too flip flop. Yeah. It was way too flip flop the way the way the ties changed in the in the movie. But the rest of the movie was pretty nice. Yeah, it was pretty. I I thought it was I thought it was a you know how some uh, some horror films you know people not horror films but thrillers it's supposed to be like ah, 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 you know how stuff popping up in your face and stuff. I thought this was really funny. <laughs> I thought it had like. I like there's just moments where it's really funny, like when she when Esther was threatening uh, the kids, you know. Oh my god! And that was funny because she okay. had this, she had killed some woman. I think one of the sisters. She killed one of the. She killed one of the sisters, and then yeah. she went to like the the uh, the deaf girl. Well, a girl that couldn't hear. <laughs> she went to a girl that could, she couldn't hear, and she said, "You're not gonna tell anybody about this, are you?" And the little girl was like. <laughs> that was a and I was like, <laughs> you, she, you, that, like that girl who would say yes? Who would say you're not gonna tell anybody after you kill like uh, a basically a grown woman? You're not gonna tell anybody. <laughs> okay, I'll just kill you now. So oh, uh, I mean, I mean that little girl valued her life. And Danny, when she first threatened Dan, oh, Danny, wow. oh Danny was hiding behind a rock. <laughs> And she and she and she uh and she creepily jerked her head jerked her head toward the rock, yeah. you know, just to, you know, just the creepy type. And uh, she saw she saw him, but she still walked away. Waited till the waited till the little boy went to sleep. Took a box cutter to the kid's neck. <laughs> it's it. Took a you're box cutter. You're not gonna to the tell. Kid. You're not. You you're not gonna tell. <laughs> you're not gonna tell. He's like. He's like you you uh you tell somebody and I cut off your 
a cut off your pitch before you know know how to use it. I'm like, oh my goodness. It's private. It's private. It's private. Right? Cut man. off your pitch before I you know how to use it. I know, man. That was a good line. That that, that, that right scared line. me. That that just freaked me out. I'm like, and then you know, it was just crazy. I just but I like the the humor. It was so much more humor than Harry Potter, you know? Yeah. You know, sorry. It's our Harry Potter fans. This but. movie was better than Harry Potter. <laughs> My long shot. All right, Devin, what's the score? Uh, you go first. Me? <laughs> Nine out of ten. Nine out of ten? Yeah. I don't think it was that much. Uh, I'll give it like a eight. No, actually, I'll give it a seven and a half out of ten. Seven point five out of ten. That brings it to about. Uh, that brings it to about eight out of ten. Do the math. <laughs> Yeah, I'm just, gonna, I'm just going in between. Oh, uh, yeah, about eight out of ten. Let's give it a fair, fair score. The Orphan gets an eight out of ten. <laughs> All right, th thank you, everybody. This is uh, this is um, this is Mount Bear, and this is Deep. Hey, <laughs> farewell. Take care. And I don't know what our next our next uh, our next review is gonna be, but let's try something other than a movie. <laughs> Woohoo! No movies. Nah, nah, nah. We don't mind. We don't mind the movies because we can get them cheaply. But, <laughs> but uh, let's try something other than a movie. All right. Take care. Uh, this is a farewell from uh, Infinity Critics. We'll hope to see you next time.